Hello. The video you are about to see contains images of dolls only. Good morning everybody. Happy Wednesday. How are you all today? Um, it's another fluffy Roman slippers for me because I woke up dizzy again. Um, but we shall remain undaunted. <laughs> now, today I have got Marcellus with me. Um, everyone seems to be quite divided about Marcellus. I always get a lot of Facebook comments whenever I show him. And some people really think he's amazing and some people think he's really creepy. Um, which is fine, actually. He is creepy, but he's also cute. Um, aren't you, darling? You can't help... Ah, ah, ah. Don't you go for my hand. That's what I get for putting my hand in your mouth, isn't it? But the thing... I mean, he's not... The thing about him, he's... A, um, for those who can't see him and haven't been with me before, he's a zombie baby. Um, but he isn't dripping gore and goth looking and he hasn't got fangs or anything like that. He looks pretty normal apart from the fact that he's got some blue veining and a little bit of black around his mouth but the thing that makes him look a zombie is his eyes. He's got the most incredible milky blue fading to white eyes and they're what makes him very very different and he was made by Bean Shanine of Twisted Beanstalk Nursery and I was so lucky to get him, he is pre-owned but that doesn't matter, does it, darling boy? Uh, I'm going to need to take Wigglesworth off you. Can I have Wigglesworth? Thank you. Wigglesworth is a snake, a rubber snake, and Marcellus loves him. He doesn't like soft lovies. He is apt to tear them to bits. <laughs> so he likes Wigglesworth. Don't you, my precious? Let's get this off you because I'm going to change him into one of his favourite outfits. I don't know why he likes this one so much, but he really does. So we're going to change him. Aren't we precious? And then we might give him a quick feed. We'll see how I feel. There we go. So I haven't got very much to report. That baby's still up there on eBay looking at me seductively and I'm trying very hard to resist it daddy really wants us to have a girl I really should go up there and look at it should I Marcellus no he says you should not mummy because you know what happens when you look at babies there we go so what I've got this is a mayoral outfit that I got from Children's Salon. And we have got light grey trousers with the cutest little bear's ears look coming out of the back pockets. <laughs> it's so cute. And um, a white top with grey sleeves. And the top's got these little bear ears and a bear face. And it's just such a cute outfit this I really like it and it's because it's these pale colors they really suit Marcellus with his very pale coloring don't they my precious yes they do they suit you beautifully don't they and they're nice warm and snuggly and Marcellus does need snuggly clothes, even though the weather is getting warmer because he's, he's always sub-temperature anyway. Aren't you, sweetheart? So you need to be warm, even in the summer. You do, don't you? Yes, you do, my little zombling. There you go. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. My that head. Floppy head. What a floppy head. this up. Such a good boy. He's such a good boy. He's actually getting 
a lot less lungeous as time goes on. That's a lovely old medieval word, lungeous. He used to be always going for my hand and, and anyone get near him, he would go for them, but he's getting better as time goes by, especially as he's getting used to us all. My son, your hair is tickly. Your hair is tickly. I watched a very good movie last night. Um, it was called 45 Years. It was made in 2015. And it starred Charlotte Rampling and Tom, Tom Courtney. You might remember Charlotte Rampling in, I think, if I'm right in remembering, Call the Midwife. Um, Tom Courtney's one of our great British actors. And it was about a couple who are about to celebrate their 45th wedding anniversary. And does this one do down the front? That's the back, Penny. Back. Ha! Ah. Silly mummy. Anyway, um, the week before the party, the husband gets a letter to let him know that the Swiss authorities have found the body of a very, uh, a girlfriend he used to have in 1962, who had an accident and fell into a glacier, and who he has obviously never forgotten, and it sort of upsets all kinds of apple carts. It's a kind of thriller drama thing. Um, and it was very good. Very good indeed. They were both brilliant in it. Can't imagine what it'd be like to be married for 45 years. I hope I get the chance to find out. <laughs> I'd love to be married to Mr. B for 45 years. <laughs> Lean forward, my precious. Oh, I didn't think you were listening, elephant ears. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you would change your computer working out. I was, but... <laughs> there we go. There he is. There he is. Oh, doesn't that look cute on him? It does. Let's have that, those sleeves up just a itty bitty bit, my precious. Let's just have them up a itty bitty bit. There you are. So that, um, I'm going to give this hair a teensy tiny tidy up, I think. It's my water spray. Lean forward, my darling. There's a good boy. Ah! That's sprayed all over my hand. Tss, clever. I want to thank you for all your sweet comments this week really have sent me some really nice ones. Just been so incredibly lovely. Um, it does cheer me up on my bad days when I see your sweet comments. So lovely you are. There we are, my precious. Does that feel better? There. Oh, that looks better. I love mohair, but it does, it does fuss up so fast. So, I don't think I'm going to chance wobbling up to feed him. I think we're going to leave it here for today. Um, I will not be here tomorrow because it's Rhea's day off. But Mr B and I will be back on Friday. Don't be too surprised if you see a box opening. <laughs> I'm trying to resist temptation, but it's... It's a bit difficult. <laughs> um, no, I probably will resist temptation because Mr. B really wants us to have a girl. Um, I want him to have what he wants. So anyway, I'll be back on Friday. I've got an idea that I might do something with um, Tommy and Zori um, because I haven't been with Tommy for a while. So we might do something with them. In the meantime, um, I hope you've enjoyed seeing some of the bigger babies this week. 
And um, so until we meet again on Friday, take care of yourselves and enjoy your babies. You're going to say bye-bye, Marcia. Yes, you are. Good boy. What a good boy. So take care of yourselves and enjoy your babies. And let's be good to each other. Bye-bye.